Shout first here, welcome to this video. Oh, more things are happening on Big Brother Street. Yes, yesterday, uh, Fina arrived in Ghana, and of course, today she's doing the normal cultural traditional shoot of uh ghanaian culture and this time around uh, she's been seen in the northern part of ghana culture office so definitely we are expecting gorgeous gorgeous and beautiful pictures out of this uh photo shoot i guess she's not only doing the northern part i mean it's always a tradition that when you go to ghana you are definitely going to wear um they are kente cloth so definitely i'm expecting to see uh you know another shoot in the kente cloth as well so i mean uh looking at the speeches i mean looking at this video actually you are going to be seeing so many beautiful pictures out of it and her fans in ghana have begun treating her like the princess as the beautiful winner that she is so yeah kudos to finishes in ghana you guys are doing well and of course if you listen to this video um, the healing um, they are healing her giving her all the chairs now let's get into today's business guys <laughs> a whole lot is happening and this time around it is chomzy hmm Choma Chom Chom Chomzi is the one on the dragon board today. And I, I don't know if I've said this in my previous video that you know living the soft baby lifestyle is expensive. Like, you know, when you want to belong or you want to be among those ladies you see on the ground living that lavish lifestyle, it is expensive. And of course, if you're not doing anything tangible to attached to the resource that you are using in all this uh, lifestyle it's always going to be attached to a man now it's rumor this blogger uh this blogger called uh, cute juice on instagram broke the news that omo chumzi is dating a married man yes that is how the news broke on the net yeah she is dating a, a married man according to the blogger she said uh, chumzi i mean she mentioned her full uh, government name is bent on taking this figure from his wife sha how can one be dating person husband and be posting this kind of nonsense and auntie thinks she's forming cool chai bringing your main coco all this ones now warm up just use some um, whole body be right back so yeah that's the blogger who broke the news and of course the person i mean the blogger has been sharing little bit of the gist on her page and of course uh big brother street is on fire <laughs> yeah it's on fire and as this dragon is going on the evidences of uh you know uh tattoo and charm on the other hand say tomorrow is my birthday make sure you not send gift uh when i when i'm back i'll from belly i'll collect them and she's also sent uh another laughing emoji laughing at those who are dragging her well it didn't just end the chomzy on the other hand went ahead again to don't forget to use hashtag chomzy so uh she's trying to say if you are dragging her make sure you use the hashtag chomzy so that she can trend um not uh, that alone did they use hashtag i want the ha <laughs> i want the hashtag i mean she's particular about the hashtag so um <clears throat> the blogger cute juice went ahead to check if um <clears throat> Chomzi is following the said man and of course you can see right there that you know Chomzi is following the the man that she, allegedly she is dating well uh when she posted this picture i think i shared it on a, a video saying that you know she's really living the soft life and enjoying herself now this picture shows that she's using the same bag as the said man well in all of this blue her heart is going on the man came out to say that you know what this is the man's disclaimer please so i am not married though i broke up with that uh, girl since last year and she is not the mother of my child though and i just got into a new relationship recently please you people should uh you know mind your business and anyways just for information stop dragging chumsy that girl made me heal from my broken heart uh when um, um when when my ex dumped me for another man woman mind your business and face your own family Emo bingo Omo, 
so yeah well i mean information is still coming out that the guy or the man has been celebrating wedding anniversary with the with her previous i don't know what to say, whether it's a previous wife abi wife and there has also been allegations of uh, you know physical abuse here and there um in the said marriage so these are some screenshots of the informations that are coming out uh from this particular allegation guys uh i don't even want to bore you guys in readings you can just pause and read some of this uh you know information or some of this uh you know thing about this particular allegation between you know uh chomzi the said man called figo and the wife so this is the marriage ceremony or marriage picture to show that the man is uh, a married man i don't know i mean the guy has come out to clarify that he's no more married to the said lady um for me my take on this is very simple very very simple you know you are dating if you are dating a well, I don't even know how to put my own thoughts in process so that some of you will not know, some of you will not take offense in what I want to say. My own is simple. If you are dating a married man, I don't know why we always end up blaming the woman in question that is a statue. What of the married man? Is the married man not responsible for his or his own action? Why are we always blaming the woman or the statue in this situation? Now, secondly, it's, it has always come to a notice that when a big brother Niger house meet, especially the ladies are living a lavish life, it's always a man. And at the end of the day, we've always found out that, well, it is a man that is actually sponsoring that lifestyle for some of these ladies. I mean, uh, White Money has come out to say, say so, uh, some time back that the ladies are doing you know, married men and getting money from them are doing hookup for men and they are getting my I mean, doing on the other hand, some time ago, agree that being a side chick is not bad, that, you know, you can turn a customer into a wife material, you can turn a wife material into a customer. I mean, she agreed that, you know, that is exactly what they do and there's nothing wrong with it. So at the end of the day, whatever you are doing, just make sure that you are not, you know, harming, you're not, you're not hurting somebody in the process you're not put you know your, your your actions are not putting pain on another <clears throat> person whether they eat marriage they eat friendship they eat whatever just make sure you're not putting pain on another person and the room i mean maria was in the same situation she's not married to the said guy anyway but they are still together the guy hasn't come out to probably say he was not married or whatnot but then over there we found out that you know the guy was on his way or i'll be on his way to divorce his wife now this trauma situation is similar to my real situation i mean we don't know who to believe even though the guy has come out that he is no more i mean he is no longer married to uh the lady well at the end of the day the story is true she dates she is dating a married man maybe she dated someone's husband whatever but whatever it is this is the news guys uh what is your own take on this leave it in the comment section you know let's discuss is i mean uh, w what is your take on this you know trauma dating uh, somebody's husband i mean that is what it is and there are so many screenshots around right now indicating that the guy is still married the guy still wishes you know his wife birthday yell even today even though he said he is not married uh since the last year i don't know which is which uh at the end of the day this is the story. Tomorrow is uh, Chomzi's birthday. So we'll see how this news um, keeps spreading or keep evolving. I'll be here to share them with you. Thank you so much for watching. I'll see you in the next video.